You will need 100 grams of butter, 125 of golden caster sugar, one egg, half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, 200 grams of self-raising flour, a pinch of salt, and 100 grams of dark chocolate chips. Preheat your oven to 170 Celsius, 325 Fahrenheit, or gas mark three. In a bowl, add your butter and your golden caster sugar. Golden caster sugar has a much finer quality to it. And you can use an electric hand whisk or um, to beat it. I'm just going to do it by hand. Just a little tip for making biscuits. Make sure your butter is cold. This has been out the fridge for about 10 minutes, so it's soft enough to cream together with sugar, but it's not um, melting at room temperature. If your butter is um, quite warm, then the biscuits tend to split at the top. So it's, it has more in common with making pastry. When I cream butter and sugar by hand, I use the back of the spoon and just push it down, give it some elbow grease, and eventually all that butter and sugar will combine. So that's a nice even golden colour. You know when the butter's all combined when you can't see any. Fold that bad boy in. Now we're going to sip in our flour and our salt. So just a pinch of salt and self raising flour. Have um I'm going to fold it in with my spatula and sometimes you know you've got a dirty spoon and you don't want to put it on the surface so I, I put it in a cup or have a, one of these things which is a spoon holder. Um, it's, I did drop it once so I stuck it back together, in fact I think it's been dropped twice and stuck back together twice but I got it from a, just a cheap shop and it's really handy. Tap it like a tambourine if you've got the use of two hands, but I only have the use of one hand. See, it's always worth sieving when you have to sieve. Sometimes you don't have to sieve. It actually um, puts air into the flour as well as removing the little bits of hard flour. Now for what we've been waiting for, which is our chocolate chips. You could use milk chocolate chips, I just like dark chocolate myself, and also it has less sugar. There we have it, some nice cookie dough. It's quite warm in here, so because the oven's on, I'm going to put my cookie dough in the fridge uh, for five minutes, because then when you roll it out, or when I roll it out I should say, is there any room in my packed fridge? When you roll it out, it'll be cold. Because if it's if it's warm, then it will stick to your fingers. So here we go. Let it cool down then there. So using a tablespoon, just pick up, scoop up some dough. And then with flour, just going to plonk it straight on the baking tray. And with floured fingers, golf ball sized balls. But again, you don't want to handle it too much because your, you know, your hands are warm, and so we're melting the butter.
Hi, so the cookies are cooking in the oven and I just wanted to show you, this is the part that they don't show you on the British Bake Off. Um, not that I, well anyway, they'd never show you the cleaning up. Now every day when I teach five days a week in schools, um, I teach the kids to clean up as well if we get time. Some days we don't get time and they and I do it, but um, I don't have any helpers here. Well, I have my hubby, but he's at work. <laughs> and we don't have a dishwasher because our kitchen's quite, it's a petite kitchen. So, as they say, no pain, no gain. <laughs>